I've always liked this quote that my coach told me. He said, fatigue is the best pillow. Meaning, if you guys are having trouble going to sleep at night, if you guys are fucking anxious, if you guys are tossing and turning, if you guys are on your fucking iPhones, your fucking your smartphones all day, just fucking watching YouTube, watching random bullshit, just to fucking kill some time so you can go ahead and get distracted and doze off. And if you're fucking doing this shit for fucking minutes, fucking hours and shit, man, you gotta, you gotta reflect and see what the fuck are you doing the whole day. If you're not fucking going to sleep, tired as fuck, exhausted and shit, that means, man, you're not, you're not leaving everything on the fucking, fucking table for that day, man. You know, you should be fucking, you should be handling business from the time you fucking wake up to the time you fucking go to sleep. So next time, man, you have trouble fucking going to sleep and you're fucking finding that you're just wasting fucking hours of fucking precious time, reevaluate, reevaluate your day and make sure you're fucking, you're, you're doing the most each fucking day. All right. A little short clip for you, but I just wanted to put it out there for you guys, man. I used to be on my fucking phones all day at night, man, just fucking just waiting to knock out. Sometimes I'll be in fucking bed for like an hour or two, just watching bullshit ass clips, distracting myself so I can fucking, so, so I can go to sleep. And I don't think life is meant to be lived that way, considering how short life is, man. So, man, every day when you wake up, man, fucking go handle your business. If you don't have any business to handle, man, make sure you go ahead and reflect and fucking find something that that calls to you, man. That fucking calls to your conscience. But you can't realize those fucking signs and those calls, man, if your fucking mind is constantly, constantly being diluted with shit that's taking your fucking focus away from infinite intelligence man sorry that shit got too deep but man if you're constantly getting fucked up you're trying to fucking escape your reality through fucking drugs through fucking liquor and shit you know you're not attacking the root of the problem you're just trying to fucking escape the life that you have instead of building the life that you want you know what I'm saying so you know if you're fucking content if you're satisfied with where you at right now you don't have to listen to this but if you feel like you could be doing more, man, just you know, hopefully if you guys have any issues with fucking whether you, whether your advice is bad, hopefully you guys can be able to get in, get control of that, man. Because if you're not a master of your fucking of your vices, man, your vices will be a master of you. Same goes along with your habits, man. I recently just read a book, a great quote. It said. Good habits are easy to, de to develop. I'm sorry. Good habits are hard to develop, but easy to live with. And bad habits are easy to develop and difficult to live with. You know, it's easy fucking going, smoking something or putting something on your fucking nose or fucking drinking something every time you feel like life is getting too fucking hard. So you try to run away, run away by fucking by fucking numbing your fucking senses and shit through that fucking shit when you should be fucking fighting it and toughening it out so fucking it can unlock fucking different thoughts in your head you know once I got off of fucking drugs and alcohol man my fucking my vision my fucking mind got so much more clear and the fucking the voices from the fucking universe you know I can I was able to fucking realize those voices man those, those, those fucking voices that fucking That helped me out a lot Were fucking getting louder and louder Each fucking day Maybe it was rewarding me For fucking For changing my fucking lifestyle and shit You know When everybody was fucking going out Fucking getting hammered and shit Like the way I used to You know but I decided to fucking stay home And just focus on myself Regardless of how boring it was that's why I just, that's, that's life rewarding me and shit, you know, it might not come fucking quick, as quick as you want, but like my coach also says, man, your level up will never fucking come at your expected time frame or within your expected budget, man, so you have to fucking stretch out 
You have to be fucking patient. Yeah, man, you just gotta invest in yourself, right? So, this video was a little bit longer than I thought, but thanks for listening, guys, man. Hopefully, you guys found some value in this video. Like I always end on my videos, man. You only have one life, so make sure you make your mind, your body, your soul, your relationships, your business, your finances, your life to die for. Peace.